one giant huddle for a Clay County teenager. His teammates and friends overcome by emotion about the sudden loss of their friend, Ben Johnson. He's very caring, so I appreciated that about him a lot. The 16-year-old collapsed in the weight room at Fleming Island High School Tuesday afternoon, and his family says he died this morning after suffering cardiac arrest. So tonight in their grief, friends and family gathered at the school's JV football game to lean on one another. The team also carried a flag with Ben's number 78 on it when they entered the field to begin tonight's game. That game was at the Fleming Island High School Stadium tonight, and that's where Corley Peel is live, joining us with how Ben is being remembered tonight. Corley? Kit and Joy, the amount of love and support for Johnson was undeniable here tonight, and many people showed up wearing his favorite color blue and pins with his number on it. Now, I spoke with some of his friends out here, and they say he was a rare friend to have. Loved ones light up the field as they form into the number 78 Thursday night, remembering JV football player Ben Johnson. Evan Bossert says Johnson was more than just a friend. He was like a brother. He always had, he was that kind of guy that just had your back and uh, he, he was always there for you. On Thursday, the Fleming Island Junior Varsity played their game in honor of Johnson. Players walked onto the field waving his number 78 and fans sporting his favorite color blue. Johnson's doctors say he died from cardiac arrest and irreversible brain damage after collapsing while working out in a school weight room on Tuesday. It's important to me to be here because we're supporting him and we're supporting his family and we're just supporting all his friends and loved ones. And both football teams putting their rivalry aside and coming together. I think, I think it's amazing what God does in, in all of our lives and um, just to see everybody gathered together as one is, and to just show their condolences and everything, it's just amazing. At the end of the game, the only score that mattered was 78. Bossert says although he's going to miss the days joking around with Johnson, he knows his friend and brother is watching over everyone from heaven. Know that you say it, those who believe in you. Now those wanting to support Johnson and his family can donate to his GoFundMe page. We have a link to that page on our website at newsforjacks.com. Reporting live from Fleming Island, Corley Peel, Channel 4, The Local Station.